Yay! <laughs> Yay, dude! What happened? Something broke? Lizard? He was on all the way here. <laughs> I had one on my hood on the truck the other day. I was coming down the dirt road and he was like oh, jumping oh, in the air. And like floating this. on the hood. This is why I need a... It wouldn't even focus, man. <laughs> All right, negotiations have been made. Fine. Johnny is selling the wrist breaker to Trevor. Another Baja Warrior build. So now we got two frames. Well, mine's good. But that's probably because of the chain. Yeah, I just know you said there were bad bearings in it. Hey, buddy. Hello, welcome back to Go Karts Are Gone Fishing. I'm Nate, it's Trevor. We got us another project in the house. Let's take a look. Alright, so Trevor just scored this off of Johnny. This is called the ankle breaker. Well, the wrist breaker. The wrist breaker. Yeah, not the ankle breaker. Because this is the bike that broke Johnny's wrist. Um, he took the motor off and sold it, and it was just a frame. So Trevor picked it up for $50. Bucks. $50. Up, but we got that freed up pretty yeah. easy. And check out this tire on the back, which is pretty much that's 50 bucks right there. Yeah, <laughs> that's a good score right there just for the money. But everybody knows these Baja frames are are awesome, so comes with a free GoPro mount. <laughs> <laughs> it, but it works. So, what we're doing now is we're going to strip it completely down and get ready for paint. We really don't know which direction we're going to go with this one yet. We do know, or we are thinking about doing a sidecar, mm -hmm. so we'll have to see, but for now it's just going to get stripped down. Thrown together so we got something to ride yeah, and we, build everything else. Yeah, we might just throw it together with an engine and we're going to put paint on it though, right? Yeah. For we're sure. going to paint it and then... That would look cool, kind of decent. Yeah, <laughs> but maybe sidecar down the road, mm -hmm. but updates on everything else, those of you watching the golf cart videos. I got a gas pedal and a shifter in, waiting on some brake parts. Uh, my neighbor brought over two bikes, this Coleman CT200U. Uh, had a bent front end, I fixed that already. Leaky gas tank, fixed it. There's the big block Baja. And this Monster Moto had a bad back tire and the carburetor needed to be rebuilt. So uh, yeah, I just wanted to do a quick update on the shop. Because I haven't put a video out in a good long time about anything in here. So there it is. There's everything. Shot's clean. There's my Baja Warrior over there. I'll bring it out one day. I actually just ordered some. I ordered the bushings for the torque converter. Nice. Yeah, so that should help me out a lot with that. Uh, Four-wheeler's still good. I have to go through my bins. I'm sure I have a torque converter for this too. But I just use that jack shot that's already on the motor. Yeah, he actually has a motor with a jack shaft on it already that yeah. goes on, that goes oh, on, wow. yeah, that goes on a bot. It was actually on this one, and he took the jack shaft off and everything, so that'll literally bolt right up to that, and that'll be good to go. But, yep, we just wanted to give you a quick update on the shop. Grind those babies, cut those, cut those babies off of there. Do the same thing to the front. Might have to. Might as well. Yeah. Cut them off. Like that thing was red at one time. Yeah. Might have grind her out. She is gonna need some serious paint work. Got rust all over the forks. Work for me. 
here's my dog again crying. Got a little fender's got a little surface rust on it. A couple little bends. Oh, we probably could have took this. So we know how to put it back together. <laughs> 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 Let me get a quick look. Okay. <laughs> Coming back around. <laughs> Somebody see it. Do one more and the whole thing's back together. No, no, I'm already <laughs> recording. <laughs> oh my god, what kind of operation are we running? <laughs> so we're pulling the forks off, or he's pulling the forks off, I'm just holding the phone. Bearing first. Can't drop the balls. Don't drop the balls, check. <laughs> All that bottom stuff looks dry. This is good. This is going to be all clean when we put it back together. If I can help it. Works work. Unicycle? I was just going to say, let's make a unicycle instead with a predator. Cool. <laughs> I ain't riding that. Yeah, if we make it to where you sit like this. Maybe put a little back wheel or something like that. Yeah. Oh, Lord. Yeah, we got ideas. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got the back wheel off. It was a pain in the butt. And uh, we know why Johnny broke a wrist. Brake pad came off. Damn brake pad came off. Probably got lodged in there somewhere. Held it open. And Johnny went for a ride. Well, held it closed, I guess. Yeah, just locked, locked, up, up. locked up the back wheel on him. <laughs> so that's what really happened to Johnny. But we got her down to a bear. All, really, only thing left is the pegs kickstand. and the kickstand, yeah. And then I'll we'll probably take the tire off of here too. Paint those rims up real nice. Paint it all up real nice. I'm gonna force Trevor to take his time. Yeah. We uh. already went this far. Yeah. We didn't do the other one yet. No, we didn't. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. The the big Baja needs this done too, still. But all right. Good news, guys. I got the big Miller back too. I got the or, I got the big welder back. So we'll get back with you. Shake it up. You gotta shake it up the speed, bro. There you go. Keep shaking. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Come on! Oh my god! It's off! Oh! That grinder is on its last leg, folks. Had to bust out the other grinder. Frame up Restro. Guys, let us know down in the comments. Look at this. What is going on here? There's extra bracing. I've never seen this on a Baja Warrior. Comment below if you guys have seen bracing like this on the engine plate but look right there they didn't even weld it it's not even welded what well it's welded on the top yeah but that should be all, all welded. the way down the side that should all be welded too though in my opinion that's weird they probably should have just welded this and not worried about going all the way down the sides like they did <laughs> that's crazy comment let us know we we also got the forks off the tire so that's we're not going to do any more with that we'll clean that up paint that up later that's what it looks like now this is how we get all the dents and bends out of the fender that, that uh, adjustable wrench right there just works perfect for it don't listen to that music you see.
probably do the inside, or at least the, like, the lip. That would probably be easier with the wire brush. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like it was green almost. On my camera, anyway. It may have been. There's black, oh. red, silver. Radio! Yeah, that's probably exhaust fumes on there. Lick it. <laughs> <laughs> well, there she is all stripped down, folks. We got most of the rust off. We haven't messed with the forks yet. Did a little bit on the fenders. All the fenders. Yeah. I knew there was something missing. And, uh, yeah, everything's disassembled so we're going to start cleaning up everything for prepping it for paint haven't decided yet on color it's probably just going to go to back to a rolling chassis for now or this is all up to Trevor what he wants to do I so just put a 212 on it put the jack shaft you have already but just with a good paint job I told him it ain't leaving this shop without mm -hmm. a halfway decent paint job so this will be the end of part three We'd like to thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button, subscribe. We do a lot of Baja builds. If uh, you More haven't, fun. if you haven't, if you haven't seen this Baja <laughs> build, go back and check it out. 420 Baja Part One. It, there's, I think there's three parts right now, and we still aren't done with it. But uh, go check it out. And we're always doing. We always got mini bikes being built worked on other projects go-karts four-wheelers pit bikes you name it we do it so thanks for watching see ya